Hi, this is Dr. Vivek and welcome to my YouTube channel. In my previous video, I talked about the natural ways to boost your testosterone. In this video, I would like to discuss the best three herbs that I have seen in my practice, the medical practice, which gives boost to your testosterone. In this list, the first is muesli, also known as safed muesli. The botanical name is Chlorophyllum boravillinium. Yes, it's hard to pronounce. You have the options. You can remember it as a sweet muesli, muesli or chlorophyllum boravillinium. So I think muesli is the best name to remember. It's easy to pronounce also. I hope so. So in my list, this is the best help. Why? Because in many of the tests, it has been found that muesli boosts the testosterone up to 40%. Yes, it really gives very good effects. I don't know why Gokshura, Tribulus terrestris, is more uh, popular than the Muesli. Yes, Gokshura is also very effective. It is on the second number in my list, but the first I would rank the Safed Muesli, Muesli or Tribulus. But in my list, the first is Safed Muesli. It is found in the powder form. It can be found in the extract forms also. How to use it? If you are using the extract form capsules, then it can be used from one or two capsules, two times in a day, empty stomach. You can drink it with warm water or either you can drink it with the warm milk. I will prefer the milk if you don't have any of the problems or the intestinal problems with the milk, then you can go with the milk. In powder forms, the dose is 3 to 5 grams. It's about 1 teaspoon, 2 times in a day, also empty stomach, with water or with milk. So this is about the first one. The second is, as I have told, Trebulus terrestris, also known as Trebulus, also known as Gokshura. Now it is very famous all over the world. You can find it with the name of Trebulus in all of the sports shops and all of the shops where the sports nutrition has been sold it is known as the testosterone booster the natural testosterone booster yes it is also effective but as i have seen in my practice if you are taking gokshura it can cause constipation or kind of a disbalance in the digestion so it is better to take a medicine or an herb which can help you in the digestion also for this, you can go for Trifla. It's also very beneficial for the digestion. It's super herb, I can say in this way. It's actually a combination of three herbs. I have a whole video about it. I'll put the link down below. If you are interested, you can see this. But let's now talk about the Gokshura, the Tribulus. Tablet form, two tablets, two to three times in a day. Empty stomach. If you can find it in the powder form, then you will take it one teaspoon two times in a day, also empty stomach. Either you can mix it with the water and drink it, either you can just take and drink the water as you are comfortable. Moving forward in this list, the third is Shilajit. It's not the herb actually, it is a kind of a paste that comes out from the Himalayas. Yes, it is very powerful. I can say it's a rejuvenator. It gives very good effects to your skin. It gives very good effects to your bones. If any kinds of bone pains you have in this also, it gives very good effects because it is anti-inflammatory. And plus, it gives very good effects in boosting our testosterone. The dose is very important. It's one to two grams maximum. You can mix it with water and drink it. Either you can mix it with milk and you can drink it two times in a day. It's morning and evening. But you have to be very conscious with Shilajit. If you increase the dose, you can have the pimples or any kinds of skin problems because it's too hot in the nature and it can give effects to our skin. So be aware of this. Do not increase the dose and you can take it two times, even continuously for three to five months. All of these, the three herbs that I have said, you can take them three to five months. What I will recommend is use Shilajit and Muesli, both of them together. Stay healthy, stay happy.